Hey, today I'm going to show you how you can test a relay on any car in less than 60 seconds. So let's go inside the van here and we'll show you how we're going to do it. So what we're going to need for this is a multimeter. This one is a Milwaukee. It's got an audible beep on it, which makes it handy for us. And there is the code and serial number for this part. It's a Milwaukee electrical tester, part number 2212 or hyphen 20. If we look on our relay diagram here, 85 to 86 is the coil. So we can put our battery across there. And you'll hear it click. And then the power supply line that goes across is 30 to 87 there if you can see 30 to 87 now we're going to bridge from 30 to 87 across with our multimeter and then we're going to go back to this one and you can see there it's giving you an audible beep to say there's power going through there's a relay with the cover off Sorry, my camera's auto focus in there so when you see you put the battery up to connect it you can see the coil there jumping in and out so your coil goes across here your main power supplies obviously are on these two and this is your ignition which cuts it across So you can see there, it's just a real easy way of doing a continuity test with the relays. It's, it's nice and easy because you can hold the uh, 9 volt battery in your pocket. Just connect it, you don't need, need loads of different wires and plugs. We we do other, we use other ways of doing it, which is uh, with a probe tester, or you can get a battery and some cables and connect it, but it's just all a big faff and you've got loads of wires hanging around everywhere. Just a 9 volt battery and your multimeter. If you've got crocodile clips on them, you can buy the crocodile clips uh, to attach to your multimeter, which makes it a lot easier as well. Crocodile clips, 9 volt battery. Takes you once you once you've learned how to do it and you do you do it all the time. Takes you 20 seconds to do. And if you if you're testing more than a few different relays in a car, it's really quick and easy, nice and simple. So I don't know if there's anything either either I might have left out or any other tricks that you know, but you can always add them down in your comments there. So we'll see you in our next video.